Hi, I'm Nina Fox and welcome back to my channel. Um, if you couldn't tell, I'm actually sitting on the floor in my living room um, because that was the most comfortable place to sit. But uh, we are talking about fitness. I've been posting several fitness videos. Um, so subscribe to my channel if you wanna see those. Subscribe, I think, right there. And I'll post the link to the last video at the end of this video so you can look at the things that we've been talking about um, on my fitness journey and your fitness journey because if you're grown the struggle is real um, at any rate so we were talking a lot about fad diets and things like that I'm going to talk some about meal prep in other videos but in this video I want to give you an update a good part of getting ready to compete or just being really fit as you get older is um, cardio for most of us we don't like cardio but we have to do cardio so for me, I try to add some spice to my cardio, and I do a lot of things. I get on the Stairmaster, which I have one in my house downstairs, but I also go to the gym, and I ride the elliptical trainer. Um, the AMT is one of my favorites. I run slash walk on the treadmill. I really hate running, so I try to get as close to a run for as long as I can as possible. Um, I also love spinning. I go to both Flywheel um, and I go to Soul Cycle. They're both in my town, but I made a major decision just a couple of days ago. Um, I decided that I wasn't gonna do that anymore because when you calculate out the fees for, both of those are about $30 a class, tw twice, at least twice a week because I'm doing other things. It gets really expensive. And considering that my trainer has me doing cardio twice a day, that's a lot of money that I could spend for something else. You know, me, I could spend it on shoes in a heartbeat. So, as it turns out, I decided I was going to buy a Peloton cycle. Um, I don't know if you've seen the Peloton bikes. I'll put a link here. But they look fabulous. It's um, one of the big things for me, other than the cost of going to Peloton, is that you have to make time to go to the scheduled class. So, you have to get up. And you have to be there on time. And if you're not there, you can't cancel 24 hours in advance. Then you lose your money. And that's a big deal because $30 is still $30. And... Um, uh, fortunately for me, there's a flywheel like right near my office and I have both flywheel and soul cycle in my home neighborhood. But sometimes with kids and schedules, I just can't make those classes. So you end up losing your money, especially at soul cycle because your credits are only good for 45 days. So you can try to buy them ahead to get the discount because you bought more than one or you can buy them one at a time and pay the max price. Um, I do through my employer have an employee discount at flywheel, but it's still $28 a class. And I can't get to them as often as I like, so I ordered a Peloton bike. Been stalking it for days and days because it has the um, schedule classes, or you can go to a class, a live class on demand, plus some other things. Um, and it was open so long in one of my browser windows behind everything else I was doing on my computer that they kept IMing me with, can I help you? And finally I said, no, you can't help me. I'm just stalking. And they answered, stalk away. So stock no more, I press purchase, they had a deal. I can't wait for it to get here. Um, the, the delivery could have been in as quick as seven days, but that was a problem for me because as it turns out, I had surgery this past Friday and I'm out of the gym for six weeks. I may be released to do cardio in two, so I scheduled it, my bike delivery for the end of November with the hopes that I will be able to do cardio. Um, in the meantime, I uh, have altered my diet. I asked my trainer to give me a diet that would bring me down. I actually want to lose some muscle so I wouldn't be stressing as much come the beginning of the year to get ready to compete at the end of March. Um, and I'm going to the beach in December and I just want to look fabulous. So I am waiting for my Peloton bike, looking for Peloton friends. It's a big social aspect to it, like a lot of the other things today, like Fitbit or whatever else. I only found one Facebook friend who is a Peloton bike person also that I actually know. Um, so I'm looking forward to following her stats and her following mine. But I will know tomorrow maybe when I go to the doctor for my post-op how soon I'll be able to do some kind of cardio. I can do nothing that involves my upper body. Um, and that's another story. I don't know if I'll ever make a video about that. But um, I had a, my reconstruction revised because I had breast cancer two years ago and I had surgery and... I needed a revision but now I can't work out so 
here I am waiting for Peloton. When it comes, I'll do an update. We'll go through it. I'll tell you what it looks like. And I'm excited to be a part of the Pelo community. Until next time, check you later.